Hello, my name is Martin German. This brief video is part of our Digital Finance in Action series to demonstrate how finance can improve its own performance by using new digital tools and technologies. In this video, we are going to look at chatbots. As customers, many of us have had conversations with chatbots. They are often our first point of contact when we have a question about the service we have received with an online retailer, for example. But we'll soon be interacting with them at work too, as companies adopt chatbots internally. Today, we are going to show you how chatbots can be used by finance. We know from working with finance business partners that they are often asked by budget holders to make simple updates to budgets or forecasts, usually over corporate instant messaging applications. These simple updates take up valuable time. So what if a chatbot could manage the conversation with the budget holder and automatically update your planning, budgeting or forecasting system? Let's show you how we can make this a reality. So for the purposes of this demonstration of our chatbot within finance, we've just logged in to our cloud-based planning, budgeting and forecasting system. And if you see here on screen that we're in cost center 0301, and if we scroll down, we will see our training budget. And our training budget for FY18 is currently 30,000 pounds. So now let's go to the finance intranet page and start a conversation with our chatbot. So here we are on the Deloitte intranet page. And in the bottom right hand corner of the screen, I've got a chatbot icon. So I can click on that chatbot icon and it will open up a chat window. And the chatbot now says to me, welcome to the finance department. What can we do for you today? So here I can now enter in, I would like to update my budget. And the chatbot then replies and says, we can help you with that. And from here, the chatbot then knows that budgets are dealt with by people within the finance, planning and analysis team. So the chatbot is going to connect me to someone within that team, which is great. So the chatbot then replies and says, hi, I'm now speaking to Roger within the financial planning and analysis team. And Roger, who is effectively the chatbot, says, I understand you want to update your budget. Is that correct? And we can say yes. Roger then replies and says, I can help you do that, which is fantastic. And Roger wants me to confirm my name. And so for the purpose of this demo, I'm going to be Mark, and Mark is the uh, budget holder for the particular cost centre we're going to look at. Um, and then we get asked, what is the cost centre that we would like to um, update the budget for? So I'm going to say 0301, which is the um, cost centre that we looked at earlier. And uh, we then get asked, what would we like to update within the budget for cost centre 0301? So I can say, um, I would like to update my training budget for FY18. And the chatbot then says, yes, I can do that for you. Um, what would you like me to change it to? So let's say we want to change it to 90,000. And then just to double check um, that we're making the correct update, the chatbot confirms that we'd like to update the training budget for FY18 for cost center 0301 to 90,000. Have I got that right? Yes. The chatbot then goes away and updates that within the planning, budgeting and forecasting system. So the chatbot then comes back and says, I've updated that for you. So just for the purpose of this demonstration, let's log back in uh, to our planning, budgeting system and see whether that's been updated. So let's go back here. Um, if I now click on refresh, 
that refreshes the data. And if we scroll down, we can now see that training for FY18 for cost center 0301 is now 90,000, exactly as per the conversation with the chatbot. So I can now return to the chatbot and say, great, thanks for updating that. That was super easy. And the chatbot kindly replies that we're not the first person to say that and ask, is there anything else that the chatbot can do to help me today? And I say, no thanks. The chatbot then says, thanks for chatting to me today, Mark. And goes on to say that if there's any other questions or feedback that I've got, I can talk to my real life boss, which of course is myself, Martin German. So the chatbot finally replies, thanks for chatting to me today, Mark, and wishes me a good day. We hope that you found that a useful introduction to how chatbots could be used by finance. If you would like to find out more, then please do contact us.